Oh yeah. It's happening. It's time for Prison Island. Guys, don't you know Prison Island? From hip video game Shadow, the legend of uh, the Hedgehog. Hi, welcome to stream. Um, welcome to a Xenoblade stream. Uh, uh, yet another one, this game. It's the game that never ends. Uh, and that's probably fine, honestly. Um, for, for me. For me, I don't, I don't mind. Uh, you know, because Xenoblade is a good game. Um, but yeah, I don't really have too much for an intro today. Other than, like, I'm like kind of fucking tired <laughs> like i i don't know why i'm just like my body is is herded um so we're gonna do some zebdo bebdo today um hope that's all right uh this is not plugged into my uh, my headphones are not properly plugged into this speaker because my audio settings are still a little bit weird from the other day as a matter of fact I was uh, probably being a little extra loud there as well. Let me plug this in here. And pull that out there, and then we should be good. Okay. Um, I just realized, why is Elgato not working? Um, I didn't even realize. I looked over at my other monitor, and I saw everything was working over there. There it is. There it is. There's a capture. Do we have game audio? Sometimes when there's an Elgato issue, there is no game audio. Um, let me let me check the Twitch stream real quick. Gotta actually unmute and hopefully hear something. Um, let me let me check the Twitch stream real quick. Yeah, Can yeah, yeah. It's, it's and hopefully it's there. Okay, cool. Sorry that you had a little uh, repeat dialogue there. I just had to really make sure. Uh, so yeah, it's time for Prison Island, pretty much. Uh, I guess this is my most recent save file. I don't... I don't think I got a chance to play this since I last streamed it. So I think we're exactly where we left off, maybe? Or no. No, I, I think I did, actually. Did I? I think I did? Yeah, I did, and there's like a bunch of heart-to-hearts that uh, I think I can do right now. I think. Fuck if I know. Um, well, there's, there's a couple that are like available, but I don't have the right amount of affinity for it. Um, are there any here? There's one, that's the one that I keep avoiding in Satoral. Uh, there is one at Frontier. And High Antia Tomb. Oh, okay. Frontier and in, 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 yeah, yeah, okay. So where am I on quests? Because I really don't know. Um, still have these ones here. Uh, I, I knocked out some of the Frontier quests, some of the Alchemoth quests. Okay, so I've I've knocked out. It looks like most of the generic ones. In that case. All right. Well, let's start with some heart-to-hearts, and then, mayhaps, we'll move into, uh, story. Like, I, I could do quests, sure, but, um, first I would have to figure out how to actually, you know, navigate the game. I don't, I don't think I've quite figured that out yet. What, across, like, three separate playthroughs, I have, like, maybe, uh, you know, 280 hours in the game at this point? I still can't figure out how to do, uh, menuing. That, that is just fantastic, okay? You do just like Mario. Is this the one? No. Okay, so it says Frontier Village, but it doesn't specify where in Frontier Village. There was one there. How dare I? Ricky's house. If this one is the one, I'm going to be upset. Okay. I was like, Ricky better have something to do with Ricky's house. Um, Yoshi's house is also somewhere that exists. Somewhere. That one. There. Yeah, I found it. It's that one. Most definitely. 
someone just jumped off the edge, and I think it was Dunban. Well, let's mourn our loss. What? It's not this one either! What you mean? We house is at Hot Tart! Oh, this one at Apex Lake! Oh, it better be this one! There it is. True Natures. Hang on. Let's do a save so that way uh, we can get all the lore. Leave it to Laura. All right, let's see it. This flower is much like the one that used to grow by RC. Used to? You mean it doesn't anymore? Alas, the breed was wiped out. None like this grow there anymore. But its seeds must have dispersed all the way here and taken root. Is it nature beautiful? Something about the Bionis and the Mechonis don't scream nature to me, but all right, Melia. I can see you love flowers, Melia. I do adore them. I like nothing more than finding a new species on our travels. How about you, Dunban? Do you like flowers? Uh... I'll be honest, not really. I don't get the impression that you dislike them all that strongly. <laughs> Maybe it's that you like them so strongly. You can't imagine that someone might not like flowers at all. That's not what I meant, it's just... If you hated flowers, you wouldn't tread so carefully around them. I am beaten by your powers of observation. I can always see a person's true nature by how they act in public. I've studied you all ever since we met. As all wise rulers do. A ruler must know his people. My father and brother taught me much about imperial duties. I never thought I would actually need those lessons, but I will certainly need them now. However, their lessons reach far beyond the particulars of ruling. I learned how to handle myself and communicate well with people. Maybe you need a few more of those lessons. Are you saying I lack people skills? You only see yourself around Ricky and Shulk, if I might say. I wish you'd open up to the rest of us a bit more. We've all been through so much together on the battlefield. Deep down, I know that you're right. Thank you, Dunban, for your frank comments. What about his David co uh, comments? W when does he make those? I'll do my best to open up more. I didn't mean for her to treat it quite so formally, but oh well. David Buster. Monado! Alright, cool. Let's see the other routes to see... How much other lore about this plant can we get? I need to know about nature! Papa Bakla Allah. Papa Bakla Allah. Do you like flowers done, Ben? Oh, yeah, I like them. You do? This is surprising. I didn't get that impression from you at all. <laughs> and you think it's wise to judge a book by its cover? No, it's not my intention. It's just I pride myself on being a good judge of character. Fair enough. Well, it just so happens that you're right. Flowers have never interested me. The reason is... Uh, one day they wither and die. I see. Flowers are transient, so it's hard to get attached to them. As with soldiers in battle, death is always knocking. Holy shit, Dunban. You are very wise, Melia. To put it another way, I feel that loving a single flower is wrong. If we concentrate on one flower, the rest of the garden may be lost. The water and the soil, the land and the skies. Which is most important, I do not know. So I give my attention to all. I started thinking about it like that in my younger days. I'd never considered it from that perspective before. You see things very differently to me. It's most intriguing. I intrigue you now. I'll take that as a compliment. You are welcome. I think I know the perfect flower for you. The renowned Stardrop. 
None can deny its beauty. All other flower bow down and wit wilt at its magnificence. Lovely as it sounds, I'll have to pass. If it's a present, I won't say no, but only because it's you, Melia. What's that supposed to mean? Hang on, what happens if- Now I gotta know what happens if I give Dunban a star drop. Does he, like, fucking hate that shit? You know, if anyone needs to give it to him, it's Sharla right now. Where is- Do I have any? I have- Unless he really likes it if it comes from her. No. Lukewarm to it. Alright, whatever. Just wasted those star drops. It's fine! This isn't the canonical timeline anyways. Why's Dunban gotta be so fucking obtuse though? Yes, I am wise and cool. I don't like flowers because they die. Let's see the other route of this direction. The reason is because of their pungent smell. You do not like their smell. Certainly some flowers have pungent smells, but not all. I know what I like, and that doesn't include flowers. A room's natural smell can be overwhelmed by a flower's odor. Odor. Oh dear. The natural smell of the earth and trees is completely lost. Is that not a contradiction? Flowers are a part of nature. I'm surprised at you, Dunban. You're a sharp one, Melia. I guess you've got me there. What? Okay, so that was just a poop conversation. It led- it, that got us nowhere. I hate flowers. Oh, do you? Yeah, but also not really. What do you mean? Yeah, but also not really. Huh? You no, know, yeah, but... Not... Not really. Hey. Hey, Peter. Yeah, but not really. Peter. Yeah. See the second best option. Then tell me about Shulk. Why Shulk? We we were talking about you. Shulk is a strange one. He plays with junk, you know? He plays with his junk. Yet to tell yet you trust him implicitly. I just wanna know why. It's not just Shulk, I trust all of you. And I appreciate it, Melia. Even though I know I am second to another. H how dare you? I would never suggest that Shulk is first in my estimation. I believe you just did. Enough of this conversation! You are not second, third, or fourth, you are last! Damn. <laughs> that, that was the second best affinity option? I felt like they, they should have, like, you know, died there. Like, fucking Melia was about to pull a gun on, on him. <laughs> okay. Alright, well, there's that heart to heart then. Um, we need. Not that. We need to see where that other one was at. Hi, Entia Tomb? Okay. Alright. Let, let us go. My people need me, let us go! Isn't that the one that's like right there? I think so. Up and away! Oh yeah, the music of hell. Now, which song are you referring to in that moment? Uh, are you referring to the fucking... The song of, of uh, Magna Forest, or are you referring to this lovely song? The 
the song of Prison Island, which will be soon. Lost Impact. What the fuck is that? The only impact that's lost to me is Genshin. <laughs> Which song is Lost Impact again? Kill all them artificial chaos. Now I now I really don't know what we're talking about anymore. <laughs> and Dunban is vomiting on command. That was not what I wanted to do. Alleyoop. Echoes of ancient times. Uh, let's just save right here. Once again. It doesn't matter how many times I come here, it still amazes me. It's impressive, all right. I can't believe it's so old. Do you not have such ancient architecture near your colony? Nope. Well, still looking at all shining new and like this. Magmel Ruins in the cl is the closest, but it's taken a beating over the years. Then it truly is a unique place. So that, uh, glow thing, what's that all about? I'm afraid I don't know the answer. It's a mystery to me, too. Let's go take a look. I guess you wouldn't know, but that thing roughed us up good. And my guess is that it would be the nerve center of the tomb. Perhaps the tomb's defense systems were activated. Do you know how it works? Ether or something, right? You're probably correct, but how is that possible? This was built many years ago. The technology to extract high quantities of ether energy is new. Us Holmes could do with that. Uh, mind sharing it with us? We're uh, a bit behind with stuff like this. Floating cities and sky machines are a bit advanced for our lot. If you're in need of technology, we'd be happy to share it with you. We high here will no longer shut ourselves away to others. So you'll help us! Brilliant! No more getting shouted at by old Squid here. Oh, uh, Vandercom is dead. Rip. He hates it when we don't find cylinders. Who's this Square Tash? Oh, forget it. It's nothing. Just me blabbering on. You reckon one day we can make those airships you lot have? It'd be amazing. I've always wanted my own plane. Cheers, Melia. It's gonna be great. I... Uh... Feel we've drifted slightly from the subject at hand. Regardless, from now on, the High Entia and Homs will work together. Hand in hand, we'll restore Colony 9 to its former glory and beyond. Fuck Colony 6, though. Fuck that place. No one likes there. Especially not Juju. Otherwise, Juju would have moved out long ago if he truly liked it. That's why the Mechon crucified him. Now, why did I do that? I hit load instead of save. That was... Ah! Oh, yeah! Fuck yeah, dude! Well, looks like we're going through the, the best route again. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll just go back after. Let's see. You mean you don't know? What, did you skip tech class in school or something? I am leaving. Easy, Melly. I was just joking. Also, there's a cliff over there. Where the fuck are you gonna go? Well, I see. Reaching a little, don't you think? According to the Ministry of Research, it's the tomb center. Perhaps the defensive systems were activated. Oh, so you did know. Pretty amazing for something you lot built ages ago. What's with all the uh, scribbles on the wall? Is that your alphabet? That is an ancient script. 
depicts the battle between the Bionis and Mechonis. Bio? What bio? Oh, you mean the one in the mouth Bionis and Mechonis fought forever ago? If you know already, why bother asking me? Yeah, I... Uh, I just remember I learned about it in school. You're a strange one, Ryan. But yes, these are thought to be writings of that ancient battle. So you don't know exactly what it says here? No, only those that ascend to the throne are able to read it. It's like a code that must be unlocked. I mean... So you can't read it at all? And I thought you were pretty smart. If all people should avoid making remarks about intelligence. <laughs> you got me there, Melia. I, did you feel that? Oh, it feels like a fly bit me. Huh. Can't say I've felt that one before. You also can't have a rainbow without a rhyme. Huh? 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 I'm sorry, Shadow the Hedgehog is the best video game of all time. Actually not a bad soundtrack though, like in all like real reality. Really realities. But you kept it to yourselves. We could have made loads of really good weapons, you know. <gasps> Maybe even stopped the Mechon from murdering our families. You are right, Ryan. I need to get this away from me. We High Entia choose to turn a blind eye. I'm not proud. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to blame you. None of that's your fault. No, your point was valid. That's why it has to be different. Arms and High Entia, together. We will rebuild your homes and get you back on your feet. Really? You mean it? Oh, thanks, Melia. No more squid tash telling offs. No more trips out of the colony for those ether cylinders. Telling offs? What are you talking about? Uh, nothing. Uh, <laughs> it's personal. Anyway, thanks a bunch, Melia. I am confused, but... Then I find I am often when talking to you. God damn! Fucking leave him alone! He's okay. he's just a himbo! He's just a boy! He's just a man's! <laughs> Going from black hearted evil to brave hearted hero is the biggest funds. I've actually, in Shadow the Hedgehog, only ever played through the uh, the neutral route, uh, so I, I I don't know really about like. Actually, I know that there's like I tried going like the evil route, and like there was the part where like Knuckles said shit, and then my dad took the game away from me. You you can't you can't be playing this right now, son. The damn fourth Chaos Emerald isn't even a bad... It, what didn't even upset him. It was when Knuckles was like, This shit's crazy! Or uh, Fuck, I forget what he exactly said. But there's like a level city where like you're in like a city that's getting attacked. And then Knuckles is like, Shit! Or something like that. I don't know. <laughs> Central City? It... Not the first level. It's like the third level on the on the um on the hardest route. I'm gonna need to do this because I accidentally went down this route, but I need to do this again anyways. And then actually save. First uh, level was Westopolis. Oh okay. Well that just shows you how much I remember about the game. I'm thinking of Central City. Okay. Then Yeah, that one. <laughs> Be thankful this isn't on my soundboard. After today's stream, I'll stop dooting you with Prison Island music. You mean 
you don't know. I get a drink. It's really that old. I thought there weren't any records left from back then. Or ruins. This could be the only place left. You do know a few things, Ryan. Yes, the battle was so fierce that it destroyed most of everything. Then that would make this text pretty important, if you ask me. Very much so. However, only those that ascend to the throne are able to decipher it. That means you'll be able to read it someday, right? I will, with some hard work. But before such things, we all have much work to do. And that comes first. No doubt, Melia. So let's get back to it. Hey, does this heart to heart change later in the story? Um, cause you know, ascending the throne and all that. You know what? I'm going to load this save. Uh, how many purple Pikmin would it take to make up a whole Rhine? Well, it depends. Are they like mimicking him or are they like cellularly fusing? To actually like become Rhine. Because if it's like cellular fusion, it's like three. Well, no, wait, hang on. I have I have it backwards. Sorry. No, if if they're mimicking him, it only takes like 3 because uh, you know, can't have a brain without Ryan, baby. Uh, but you know, there is a side quest here. Why this side quest at the Serith Lighthouse? What is this one up? Oh, isn't this the one? I think I have to be Melia for this one. Hello, you are Hyantia, aren't you? I am. Sorry for asking such a silly question. It's certainly a cute one, but you look like you can handle yourself. There's no need for flattery. What is it you want? Oh, you must be shy. Do you know the job of this lighthouse? Of course I do. It serves to suppress the activity of the monsters at the Sea. That prevents them from attacking Alchemoth. It's a very important installation. You're right. Everyone knows the lighthouse had some problems recently. So I asked, uh, Javrak to, uh... Why are you acting so nervously? That's not important right now. It'll take quite a lot of time to repair. If any monsters attack, we'll be completely helpless. I see. I suppose we could protect you all until the repairs are finished. That's an excellent idea. A are you sure? Decay echidnos. Shit! Shit, rock! It's fine during the day, but the monsters are active at night. We would all be so grateful if you could protect us at night. We're relying on you. Like, at night, as in... In... 18 in-game minutes? Well, I guess we're waiting. Uh, did I ever get the last thing? Oh, I did, yes! The macro passion, I think I just got that. Ether defense up. Shell armor. Still haven't gotten any collectibles in the other category. I'm pretty sure you get those through trading uh, from NPCs that exist in Colony 6. Uh, okay, so where is this thing at? Which one was it? Uh-oh. Trouble at the lighthouse, this one. Where, where are you? Oh, they're up there. I thought they were going to be down here. <laughs> What do we got? Show me what you've got. Got teeth. 
You've got bullshit and teeth. Very nice. Very cool! Immune to topple. That's unfortunate. So I don't think I'm high enough leveled, by the way. For some reason, Ryan is level 42. I, I was planning on using... Um, Shulk, Ricky, and um, Dunban today. Or maybe... Might actually swap Ricky out for... Because uh, I, I definitely want Shulk in the party today. Melia will probably be good. You know what? Let's go with this. Or... Hang on, affinity. Let's let affinity dictate here. Charlotte needs affinity with Dunban. Maybe I can do Charlotte, Dunban, Shulk then. Shulk should be in the party today, but also Melia should be too. Um. Hmm. Well, we'll do this for now. Just for just for now. It's trading with NPCs at certain areas. All but one can be received at three star. I see. I see! Can you be... Well, you, well you're top of immune, so I guess it doesn't matter. If I do that. Alright, this dude is going to fucking die. Check this shit out. Alright, so we're going to start with a Soaring Tempest. Followed into a Monado Buster. Followed into a Headshot. Followed into... I could Blossom Dance, but that's just overkill. We'll save it for the next one. And look at that! Look at that! Look at them numbers! Those were good ones! Oh, it's... it's... Three star all around the world. It's not just Colony 6. I see. Oh, I don't... I don't like how this one takes forever. We're unbeatable! I got... I, I did some questing and stuff off stream. I, I remember now. I did do a little bit. And, um... As such... I had one instance where, um... Also, I'm just noticing our, our levels are a little unbalanced right now. Um, I had one instance... Where I did like over a million damage or almost a million damage with Dunban. I'll show you. I'll show you the screenshot. I took a screenshot of the exact damage amount. Yeah, still no real use in doing the tempest, uh, the blossom dance. By the time I built up the chain attack, it was already over. Colony Star has three total, but one of them is at five stars. Oh, okay. I don't think I've ever gotten Colony 6 to five stars. Here you go. Um, that's not a million. That's 100,000 damage. All right, so that wasn't as big as I thought it was. Um, I rescind what I said. I did not hit a million. But I hit, like, six enemies at once with um, Soaring Tempest or whatever it is. And it was it was pretty good. I would like to thank the high Antia girl. Nope. Nope, you can't do that. Sorry. Sorry. Feels like a flaw, I bit me. We are all very grateful. Thanks to you, the lighthouse could be repaired. I knew I could only trust someone who knows how important it is. Splendid. I'm glad we could be of service. The lighthouse, once again, has all four of its lights. Hopefully, Earthsea will be a little safer from now on. I'm extremely grateful for your help. Think nothing of it. We simply did what we had to. I have one more thing to ask of you. Hmm. I expected as much. What is it? I would like you to thank Jarak for me. 
You can tell him yourself. There's no reason to be re reticent. I can't. If there's no reason to be reticent, then can you not tell him? Why me? You should tell him yourself how you feel. I decline your request. I understand. You are reticent as well. Do not speak as if I am like you. I am not reticent. It is just that I'm unaccustomed to doing such things. You have to get used to it at some point. You must not go through life always hiding your true feelings. I said I'm not reticent. <laughs> Good luck. Yeah, this is a new skill tree. Is what this one is. And a staff! Reticence. Uh, she said she's not reticent, but he says right here that she is. Plus, plus block rate. Ether defense. Strength, ether, agility, and HP up if no gems are equipped. Does Dunman get a skill link with her? He does. Naked Dunban plus that would be uh, pretty good then. Um, reduces damage taken from ether area attacks. I don't know what that means. Um, reduces aggro drawn when an aura is active. Is Dunban ready for naked? He's like... He is 15. <laughs> He's 15 SP away. Holy shit. Okay, uh, you're pretty close with this, with the fever thing. Um, gotta work on getting Ryan a new, uh, skill tree soon as well. I started going down this one, which, I mean, there's some fine things here. AP up is good. Attack power of the weapon is fine. Um, agility up buff would be great, again, for Dunban. Uh, really for everyone, but especially Dunban. Um, increases agility when HP is at half, so eventually I'll swap that out. Or, where was that? Wait a minute. Wait, who's doing who here? We need you to do Ryan. Which would be this one. So. What do you have? Physical defense up? Yeah, we'd rather have the agility on him. Um, you got a new thing here. With Shulk, but uh, we don't have the affinity coins for it. That's fine. That's fine. Is there anything he he has that we don't need? Medium weight armor. Why is that equipped? He already has that. <laughs> All right. Well, that that fixes that. And you got skill link with Shulk. Increases chain attack damage. I need, like, I need to kill, like, a few more uh, unique monsters to get that one. Alright. Um. Alright, let's, uh. What is this? There's a heart to heart way out there. What is that? Is there an island down there that I haven't been to? Is that why my Earthsea map isn't full? Oh, I haven't been down there yet. What the fuck is this? Hey, well, I was about to say we're about to do some story, but no, fuck that shit. I haven't been to this island. Wee. Knees gone. By the way, jumping from that height into water... In case anyone out here doesn't know, you will die. You will die. <laughs> Water does not save you like that. Do not try this at home. Oh, I know what I was going to do. I'm going to go into equipment here. I decked everyone out a little bit. Um, I'll just have to remember what we have equipped. So, to replace these ether ups with some quick step just to make... The swimming process easier. And now we're a boat.
I like how you can see the battle like happening over Prison Island right now. But like over here, these dudes are just like flying around. They're having a good time on their own. I'm so tempted to download Metroid Vanguard. What the hell is that? Also, I spent some time today uh, uh, browsing the Wii U eShop. Um, to see if there were some things that I wanted to get. And there, there are certainly a few things. Um, there's a lot of DS games. Yep, that was the last place. Wow. Oh, and fucking... This gets added to the map as an icon. I didn't remember that. Interesting. It's a mod for Sonic Robo Blast. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't know anything about that, unfortunately. Oh, man, these are just ether fight. I thought if it was going to see me, it was going to get angry, but... As long as I don't fight right now, we're good. Uh, but yeah, I, I I went around the, the Wii U eShop to see if there were some things, and there was a few tempting purchases that I haven't made, but was really considering. DM'd the trailer. Alright, I'll take a look for it, at it later. Yo, what the fuck? Asshole. Oh, I can do this right now. Well, we wanted more Ricky. Heart to hearts. Um, okay, yeah, we just have to remember that we didn't uh, do the one at um, Hyantia Tomb. Because I want to wait further in the story to see if that one updates or not. Oi, Ricky, what are you up to? Rhine Sea! Lots of fish! Fish with wings jump out of water, see? Ha 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 ha! You must be joking! There's no such thing as a fish with wings! You've lost the plot! But, Ricky, just see one! See, see! Fish fly! Oh yeah, I saw that! So, fish really can fly! As Rhine Blade Super Mario Brothers. Shit sucks. Ricky not see before either. Village and forest not have flying fish. Right then. Only one thing for it. We catch one and eat it. Ricky won't fight for himself. My time has come. I'll show all of Bionis my fishing skills. Ah, no. What's the matter with you? Ricky, remember that creatures with wings are special to knock on. If Ricky eat flying fish, Ricky get in trouble. Don't worry about it. No one's looking. No, no, no. Tonga will get mad. But Ricky, stop it. Make noise. I won't tell anyone. But that means you've got to fish twice as hard for me. Ricky not happy, but food is most important to Ricky. Ricky, get all fish before Ryan. I knew it. When food's around, you're suddenly up for it. I like these guys. Th these, this is my favorite group. Also, there's a lot of very appealing item orbs over there. Um, well, hang on. Let's not make the same mistake twice. That was the best result. This is a good result! All right, let's see how much this one differs by going down a different route. How much can really be said about flying fish, though? Stop teasing, Ricky! Ryan has lost his plot! Ryan is silly, hum hum! Calm down, Ricky. Don't get so defensive. Ricky not feel nice when Ryan make fun of Ricky! Looking at the water again, I, I can't see uh, something like that. See, Ricky told Ryan truth. 
Ellis Sea has lots and lots of strange fish swimming. You know what's stranger? How odd bionis are you 40? What? That means you're like an old man. What is, where did this come from, Bumpty? Oh, Ricky, not old man. Napon and Ham Ham, different. But the Napon I met at Colony 9 acted their age, why not you? Ryan should act his age, five. Ryan, a big baby like Riverpon. Why are you little? Oh, I'm gonna. I give up. What's the point? Ricky older than Ryan, so Ryan should show respect, Ricky. Okay, old man, I'll give it a go. You haven't got long left anyway. A anyway, oh, 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 purple buckler alarm. Ah, okay. It's true. Scots can't say purple burglar alarm. Pop, 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 pop. Um, there's some Scottish people that kind of say purple burglar alarm, 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 burglar, burglar, purple burglar alarm, burglar. I guess you were right. They even got hovering rocks in this place. I'll believe anything. Ricky went to visit many other strange places. See all the Bionis. Ricky and friends can see lots and lots of strange creatures together. Sounds like a plan, Ricky. And just think of all the food to eat. Ryan's eyes bigger than his great big fat stomach. Aye, take a look at yourself, Lardball. Ricky want to finish fighting and go traveling with Ryan as friends. Friends, huh? I'll think about that one. But I wouldn't mind seeing a bit of Bionis either. This one was the most wholesome. That's my that's my canonical ending for this conversation. They want to be friends. That's nice. It puts a smiley face on my face. Oh, big, big. Papa Bugger Allah. Silly, silly rain. What? We ain't allowed in or something? Flying fish special. It's sacred. Rain eat fish, then can be cursed. Just looks like any old fish. I reckon it'll taste great. Ryan don't understand. Ryan see Ricky has wings, no? Creatures with rings are special. Rings? I get you, it's like eating your own kinds. Gross, Ryan, but yes. Sorry, man. I didn't mean to scare. It's alright then. Got loads of tasty fish back home. Uh Ryan. <laughs> Ricky hungry now. Come on then, I'll take you. We'll have to get the uh, we'll have to get my fish and stuff. Whoever catches the most fish wins. You are on Ryan! Ricky good at fishing. Um No, I tried to look something up. Never mind. I, I was there was a clip that someone made. It was probably a TikTok, I think, um, that someone sent to me, where um, there's like a dude messing around in a in a MIDI, like a DAW or something, and um, he had this sound. Uh, bite that sounded like 
the Sonic the Hedgehog rings of like when you collect the ring, the that thing. I can't do an impression, but you know the sound. And then he's like, so I, I found what, what sound effect the ring is, but then if you take it down and you pitch it down a few octaves and then, and then it was this noise. Oh, okay, hang on. So let me give you the sonic ring noise. Is this it? Okay, so so that sound effect, right? And then when you pitch it down. Oh, I, I that was muted. Uh, apparently, apparently that's the same sound. Just pitch down. The Taco Bell. And the Sonic Bell. Uh, uh. I don't know if these are facts or fictions. I, I haven't, uh, you know, I haven't consulted uh, Jonathan Frakes on this one. But, um, you know, as Shulk would say, believe it with a grain of salt or something. All right, let's put this ether back on. Ether up three. And then we can do... You in the party. You in the party. And then you in the party. Okay, we'll do that. Popple Bagla Alam Brother, where is father? I've been standing here for oh, four yeah. days. The Imperial staff, it's so father has gone. I Callion The Emperor has proceeded to the island alone for the sake of the Empire. Why did you let him go alone? Father his Majesty is fully aware. Alvis. Oh, you get out of here with the, with the shit, Chaos. Of we don't want to deal with you. Him, and what he must do before then. You saw something. I did. During our ancient divination ritual. If he knows, then why? Because he is the ruler of the Imperial family and all the High Entia. We must respect his decision above all else. But that doesn't mean... That's some weird logic. Trust him, Shulk. His fate was decided long ago. No! <laughs> Shulk, we're going. No! Don't bows head in respect? shame. Destiny? We don't need rules to tell us when to save the people we care for. You too, Melia. Don't give up on him. The Emperor, your father, is going to die. Dumban. There's only one thing to do. Are you with me? Of course. But you can't. We are Homs. Do what you must. But well, your not. don't concern us. My apologies, Dumban. Well, I guess kind of, but... No apologies needed. So, Melia, what's it to be? We go to Prison Island. We will not waver from our destinies. However, we will waver from destiny too. Fuck that shit. Nobody plays that trash anymore. Are you shouting any insulin over here? His Majesty has departed for Prison Island. He's so brave. Dunban is phasing again. I just know you will be able to protect our Emperor. Will we? Will we? You got some you got a weird ass outfit. You know that? Anyone ever tell you that before, Lorithia? Lorithia? Lorithia or Lorithia? I'm almost there actually for that. I'm the king now. Get out of here, Callion. I appreciate Dunban's quick thinking. I'm right here, you fuck. His Majesty departed for Prison Island alone. Please, you must help His Majesty. My father. You, you were just against that just like 40 seconds ago, my dude. 
Make up your mind. Then where the hell is this? Oh, wait, this is... Oh, I know this. This is where, uh... That cutscene was. Oh, chimpanzee that! I, I didn't actually really know that... This was a place that you could find. Was that the last location, then? I think so. Um... I mean, I certainly don't see anything else for us to find. And I don't think I went through this whole loop, so I think so, yeah. Cool. Where's the plot want me to go? I can't fast travel. Can I fast travel to Aerith? No. I have to walk out. Fuck this shit! Just standing over the body <laughs> and then shulk like face palmed. Oh, this fucking. Oh, what are we gonna do now? Without Tempest Kick, we're not OP. Why does she just jump like that, though? You know what? I guess on our way out, we can turn in some quests, too. Because the quests never end! Oh, now, now the fight is getting like slightly more intense. Or maybe? No. No, never mind. I thought there was like some additional like red dots out there. Um, quests over here to turn in though. This place is so much nicer, like all lit up like this, than compared to how it is in Future Connected. You! You! Me. Yes, you! Do not feel the need to speak with those from other races. Please, leave me alone. Fine. This game really wants me to have Melly in the party right now. I'm sorry. We'll just do this group. Sorry, Charlo. You'll get your, your affinity some other time. What do you want? <sighs> so mother- what, what? What? Why are you just trying to kick that girl? So mother has been telling me, uh, telling everyone she's worried about me. Well, frankly, who I choose to despise is none of her business. The wings on your head look, how can I say, rather stunted. That means you're half Holmes. So I'd rather not speak with you if at all possible. Perhaps if you were to bring me two pieces of marine marble, then I could be persuaded to tolerate your conversation. What a weird thing. Like, obviously, yeah, this person's like fucked up for the obvious reasons. But then just be like, but you know, if you, if you give me, if you like slide me a Benjamin, you can, uh, you know, I'll, I'll hear you out. We can find marine marble at Earth C. Even a school child knows that. Goodness me. See, it's not just your wings that are stunted. I said nothing. Me. Are you about to get both? What? Both what? 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 What, what are we on about? Oh, so you brought me the marine marble. You people travel together, yes? Despite being of different races? Frankly, I cannot understand it. Very well. I'll grace you with a small amount of my time. I'll tell you why I can't stand other races of Bionis. It all started with something quite trivial, to be honest. That half-wit Vidian broke my headwing decorations. And that night, as I slept, I heard a voice in my dreams. The Bionis itself spoke to me. It said... Only those of pure high entia blood are worthy. The Bionis deemed the creators, the high entia first. Those savage harms are quite simply a joke, no offense. I'm sure you're aware Finian's blood is tainted by those savages. So she got jealous of my beautiful headwings and decorations. Clearly, she must have stolen them to smash them out of spite. Can't expect anything more, considering her heritage. 
but it doesn't even really matter. Now what happens? I will never keep up the fight. Wait, what's the lyrics to the Sonic song? I think I fucked it up. This marine marble is even nicer than my old decorations. I suppose I could forgive Vidian. That's why you're talking to me in the first place after all, right? Okay, you could do it. No promises though. I thought you were about to get her second skill tree. No idea where I actually do that. Or like her th uh, fifth one, I guess, technically. Uh, second optional one, I guess. Uh, this is superb armor. Not a scratch too, it's perfect. It must have been tough to get it. I know it couldn't have. <laughs> Looks like I was wise, wise to ask you kids for help. Thank you. Hope I was of some help. Don't worry, you were great help. Alas, we can f start constructing the deciphering machine. Here, take this. I compensate you for all the trouble you went through. It's way later. Okay. Is Melia the only uh, person right now that I can have an additional skill tree for? I don't really know the answer to that. It's a quest over there. Uh. Uh. Yeah, I'm going through these things with quick step. Fucking quick. Might as well collect some more fucking things here. Um... I'm just gonna put one quick step on because I'm lazy, but I'm not that lazy. You understand or do you understand? So I have uh, some pretty good ideas for some new emotes coming up. Um, there's going to be a little bit of a cleanup on my emotes because a lot of them are shit posts. Now, ha 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 is on screen, so shit posts are allowed to be existing in some ways. I like the bean shit post. I think I'm gonna keep that one. But there's a couple others that I'm considering uh, maybe just moving to FFZ because uh, I don't think I have any emotes on FFZ. And if I recall, streamers can do like 50 emotes on there. No, oh, hang on. Where'd that quest go? I fucking left. A fire. I missed. A fire. Well, the Bionis told her that. I can't believe it. But now you mention it, I do recall her having bad dreams one night. Just once. She has only ever had bad dreams once? Wow. What a fucking high and mighty society she must live in. I get the feeling that was the very day that she changed. How very frightening. Anyway, we, at least we've got to the bottom of this now. I hope I was of some help. Don't worry, you were a great help. Right, I'll go talk to Lesunia. She can't be allowed to think like that in this day and age. I just hope she listens to me. Okay. You know, something. Whatever you say. Oh, we got Aurora Borealis tonight. Cool. Uh, Aurora Borealis? Having a forgettable luncheon, I see. Or rather, an unforgettable one, that is. <laughs> don't, don't worry, I'm just choking. It's all normal. Probably. This lies in the space. 
Completionists are getting to fuck me. <laughs> That's a good one, Metal Face. Do you happen to know a guy, by the way? Is it too much to hope this is the last of them? Fish. Ginormous at twelve o'clock. Fun fact: ginormous is not a real word. He's got some powers full, like plosives. Cool. Now shit's getting intense over there. Alright, so we just gotta fly up there. Do you think the Emperor flew with, like, his head wings to get there? Do we need to use the transporter? We do. But first, we must unlock the seals. Seals? We need to unlock two seals to reach Prison Island. Then, a door will appear before us, showing the way. Got it. Move, everyone. It's not even funny. I don't know why I keep doing that. <laughs> Fro said, "Hee hee." <laughs> it's okay. Where does this one go? Wait, is this? Oh, this is the same one. Okay, I was confused. I thought this was on the other side, like pointing the other direction. Guess not. No, yeah, that, that that makes sense. Well, luckily for me, I've explored fucking everywhere in Earth Sea for the most part. So we can just kind of go straight to these things. Also, this exact island is in uh, uh, Future Connected for some reason. And I don't- I can't really comment if it- if it's like, laziness, or if it's like, yeah, it's cool. It's cool laziness. It's cool laid. Oh yeah! Right here! This bothers me. How did Melia get so much, like, extra XP? What the hell? When she was out of the party, the game really compensated for her. Look at how tiny the fucking... Um... I'm, oh, well, I was gonna say that, the, the platform, but actually just the high Entia tomb, even. In comparison to everything out here. Earth C. Is probably... I'd say Aerithsea is definitely the biggest area in this game. Uh, without any shroud of a doubt. And it's a good thing they have the teleporters, because... You know, makes things easier. Also, this is... <laughs> this is kind of stupid. I'm so high-leveled that I don't have to fight any of these dudes. You know what? Uh, no, I'm setting my level back down. We need to fight things. This is not okay. Alright. We'll do 45. We'll probably do just fine at level 45. Everyone can be 45. Ricky can be like... 45 years old too, according to Ryan. I thought Ricky was 35, but I guess he's just exactly 40. Okay. Well, there's that one. We'll fight the other ones on this island, I think. 
Which this island I haven't even like explored off stream. I had to do some quest stuff on that other island. Um, but whatever the hell's over here will be new to me. Got some hoads. I'm, I'm even even lowering myself by like four levels. I'm still very high leveled compared to the things around here. Isn't there like a really annoying unique monster on this path? Seem to recall that. The m Yo, that's my main cat. Some more lugas here. Oh, well, there's the sound. Well, here's the unique. <laughs> Cumulus Deimos Ex Machina. There he goes, using that Blossom Dance for no fucking reason. Nobody knows why. Useless! I guess, why expect the AI to hold on to it, though, at the same time? Oh, that was a good use of Soaring Tempest. I think. Yeah, three ether ups for no reason. Uh, let's do this. And then we'll do chain attack. Why not? It gives affinity boost. Why not? Boost! E-shulk! Hate it when they bust out the E-shulk. Aw, oh, come on, you could've- you could've let me extend that just to finish the dude off. Oh, okay. I guess he'll bleed to death. <laughs> That's one way to do it. Good job, Dunban. Fucking annihilated him. M more echidno shit. I kid you not. That's dumb. <laughs> um, excuse me, Mr. Uh, Orluga-san. Just gonna, uh, you know, pass my way around here. I remember this island being annoying on first playthrough because of how little quests I was doing. And so, like, everything here was trying to attack me. Now I've clocked over 50 hours into the game. Um, we're not even at the halfway point yet. We'll probably pass that threshold, depending on perspective anyways, on when the halfway point is. Um, we'll probably pass that point today. In my perspective, we'll do it today. But some people think... Uh, the next area will be considered the halfway point. Which, we, we won't be coming to the end of the next area today. In fact, how long have I been streaming for already? I've already been live for an hour. Um, as much as I'd love to just go, you know, like, go! Um, probably not going to do this one to be super long compared to some of my other Xenoblade streams. Why are they swimming up that ramp? <laughs> the very interesting mode of transportation you guys have, but all right. Cool. Cool! Zero XP, zero money. Bitch, I need the bonus XP right now! I don't have the sanity to be doing quests without XP! Fucking... 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 Soon.
so I um, I watched a or listened to a podcast recently. Um, apparently, the uh, old nin former Nintendo employees um, that did the Nintendo Minute made their own podcast. About and uh, their their pilot episode was all about why they left Nintendo. It's an interesting listen in a time where a lot of us are really fucking shitty with the company of Nintendo. Uh, an interesting listen to hear straight from the perspective of people who left the company on like how the company operates internally a little bit. Like they couldn't go into all the details, of course, but um, it was an interesting listen. They had mostly positive stuff to say. Actually, Mechon. and something we've never seen before. Big fish coming! Big fish! <gasps> these things have a really fucking crazy design. I love these dudes. The sky rays. But yeah, um, Kit and Krista, they made their, um, Kit and Krista podcast, as they named it. <laughs> and, uh, it, it, I do recommend at least anyone interested, um, to, to take a listen, because it was an interesting listen, at least for, while well, they were talking about that. I didn't listen to the whole episode, because then they started talking about, like, Pokemon Arceus. I'm like, this is fine. I was mostly there to hear their their thoughts about working for them as a company, and apparently this doesn't really change how Nintendo's, like, PR department handles themselves. But, um, you know, or, like, they're legal, I guess, more. Their PR is fine. It's, it's more they're legal that is kind of stupid. <laughs> Uh, but apparently they, uh, they treat their employees very well there, um, which doesn't exactly surprise me, but it's good to at least know that, uh, from the perspective of people who are no longer, like, contractually obligated to say that, or still choosing to say that. Can anyone explain what this thing is? It doesn't really change <laughs> the way Nintendo's being right now, though. Fossils discovered around the capital to find that they were trapped on Prison Island. Was it protecting the island? That would imply it's sentient. I believe it's responding to something primitive. Primitive? It doesn't care who or what we are. Its instinct was to defend against anything. But we'll never really know. We're losing time here. We still haven't reached the island. Ricky, go to island! <laughs> Dunbarn, it's sentient if it's breathing. Well, it's not breathing anymore, so it's not sentient. He, he was correct. It didn't have its... It didn't have a brain. It was just doing... You know? Oh, cool. I wasn't even trying to do that. I was trying to get sunset, but you know what? Yeah, let's do... Let's do it. Prison Island... with rain. Alright, now I can finally put the joke away. This whole island is shaped like the shit that Zant shoves into Wolf Link's body force to force him so to stay wolf form the after the water temple. Sure Forefathers, grant me your wisdom. Iluna Melrukan Taxis. Duku Aruke Maruke Ihago? Thank goodness there were subtitles. Dead. 
Yo, it's the guy from that. Devil's Third. So this is it's him. Was sealed away. Sephiroth beard. How That's right. Emperor. This is our first encounter. I knew Xenoblade took some inspiration from other RPGs, but damn, Sephiroth. The blood that shackled me. I see. He's, he's not very swollen. He's looking good these days. The reason I am here. There is no need. I already know why you have come. How is he being bound by those rings, though? I guess it's the magic. That is the reason I am here, after all. He activated the power, the latent power of tacos. Now Prison Island is shaped like an egg. That light, it's... Father. Oh man, I should have had the sound bite of Zord saying feels like a fly bit me, like ready to go, because I knew that was happening, or going to happen. If I should, if I could have just pressed that, like, right at the moment of collision, that would have been a highbrow moment. So here's real prison island. Um, I'm just gonna do. Uh, just a little bit of boost because. Um, Prison Island is uh, actually a really good song in this game, and really, um, yeah, I want to say, um, not a lot of people have like listened to it a lot. Like, obviously, yeah, you listen to it while you're here, but you're not really here very long. So. Yeah, I'm done, man! Charmy, we gotta find those discs. Is that what Charmy wanted to do on that level? I don't even think... Wait, no, that was... I was about to say, I don't even think Charmy is on that level, because Charmy is on one level in, in Shadow. But no, that is the, that is the level that he's on. Because it's got, like, all the toxic waste shit. I feel shook. Dunban, you did nothing. You stood there. What the fuck? I just got out of a fight. Dunban, what are you doing? Save me. Come on your feet. What? No. No, don't do that. No, 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 no. No. No, you can't do that. <laughs> Whoa. Let's press <laughs> on. Uh-oh, ain't no thing. Do not go on the feet. Fuck you, I hate you. 
Put some fucking soul fire over here and shit. We're about to have one of my fi w There's several lines in this game that are really good and most of them come from Rhine. But this one... This is about to be one of the best Rhine lines. Here we go. Here we go. Whoa! Big door! Whoa! Whoever needed big this door! door. Was massive. <laughs> Dino Beast! Hmm. Beak! It's Would have been better statue. if he did it in that voice, though. Don't freak us out like that, Ricky. Is this a person? I can't make it out. This may very well be the appearance of my forefathers. The fuck you mean, is this a person? Fit greatly to how we look now. And this is what they look like. Wait a minute. I've seen this thing somewhere before. Oh, Dino Beast, Dino Beast! You might be right. It reminds me of the Teletia as well. Did your ancestors build this island? Teletia. No. The stories tell of this place existing long before my people. No one knows for sure. But we think our forefathers are the ones who sealed it. I wonder what's hidden inside. Well, we'll know soon enough, I suppose. Big doors, yeah. obviously. An engraving by the forefathers. I've seen this engraving around the capital. Many researchers have tried and failed to discover its meaning. Hey, Shulk. That symbol. Yeah. It's similar to the Monado symbols. There must be a connection. Connection? Holy shit. Kanji looks like Kanji. It is said only a true successor to the throne can open it. Then the Emperor must be inside. I believe so. Ancient Japan exists in the Xenoblade universe confirmed. Fathers, I, your descendant, Melia Antiqua, stand before you. Why is she in a bathroom the now all of a sudden? World. Release the seal. And the bathroom echo. Like at the tomb. What's it doing? Aren't we going to help? You see the brooch on Please, on Melia's do not worry. Uh, like chest. It, necessary. it is an infinity symbol, which represents the infinite amount of love she gets from the fandom. Shulk. Get a move on. You saw it, right? Us bashing that Tim man's head in. Hold on a second. Ah, oh, here we go. I knew you'd start overthinking. There's not much time, Shulk. We've got to go now. Charlotte's what Tim right. Man? What? We'll miss our chance to take that murdering Mechon down. And save Melia's father, too. I... Okay. Shulk, don't do this shit again. Oh, oh, oh no, will you say something right now? Shulk! Shulk. Shulk Cola. Shulk Cola. So, like, what fucking part of this looks like a, a person? It, this is very much like dragon. Like, hatching from an egg. No, wait, hang on. It's got abs. Fuck. Oh, this is a small little detail. I don't think I've ever noticed. There's like these small little puddles on the ground. JRPG surprised by realistic rain weather. Right. 
Well, welcome to Central Hall, also known as Prison Island. Very big. And as I recall, there ain't fucking shit here. <laughs> Aren't there like not even collectibles here? Uh, oh, someone learned a new art. And it was Charler. Charler? What'd you learn? What did you learn? Um. Did you learn Aura Bullet, I think? Extends the duration of an aura. Yeah, you could do that. You could. I don't even look. Collectopedia. Yeah, no, there's no new page. Aesthetically, I love this place, though. It's like the dark shadows. Also, that looks pretty cool as well. But yeah, like the dark shadows with like the blue flame. Fucking gothic temple. What, what did I say? It appears to be deactivated. Well, appearances can be deceiving, you know. Just fucking plug it into the fucking outlet around the corner. God damn. This place got Wi Fi? What's a password? This reminds me of the time that I went inside the Lincoln Memorial in downtown Washington, D.C. And, uh, <laughs> we were renting out these electric scooters to get around the place because D.C. is fucking massive. And, um, yeah, we went inside the Lincoln Memorial and, uh, left the scooters outside and then came back and then the fucking scooters got stolen. Kingdom Heart Portal? I don't get that joke, but so someone out there will. Dunban is somewhere. He's making his presence known by yelling into the void. Mm -hmm. This is the Bionis head. And there's the shoulder over there as well. Pick up a shoulder with relative ease. Don't do it, Shulk. It's not worth it. Wow. Look at how fucking tiny the shoulder is, actually. I, I've never actually looked over the edge here. Oh, God. What was... Why did the camera glitch like that? But, like... All of that... Is like what the future connected? Oh, I guess more over that way, but still, all of that is what future connected takes place on. So, like, but then Earth C fucking protrudes all the way back there. Very interesting. Also, a long way down. But down there is the entrance to this place. So, these teleporters just took us way up high. Way up high ago. And another one. Okay, I don't get some... I don't get this, though. We've got these teleporters around. That's cool. And then there's these deactivated ones. Now, I know why these are deactivated. But, like... They could have just, you know... Linked these up... To each other. That's not as convenient, though. Are we here? 
I also wonder if at one point in development you were intended to go through more prison island here. This is the place I saw. Cause they're like all out of breath when they get up here, but it's like it takes five minutes. If you don't dingle off like I did. Oh, there he is! Yo, Sephiroth, you gotta brush your teeth sometime, dude. When's the last time you brushed? Thank goodness his beard is covering Who his junk. Are you? Check that guy out. Is this bigger than Ryan's pythons? Said to have become extinct eons ago. This is what our forefathers locked away. I am Zanza. And I have waited centuries. Zanzadon? The Napon? Waited for him. But I thought our forefathers imprisoned you here. I forged the Monado. It is molded from me. All who wield the sword are made known to me. You made the Monado. I like this dude's yes. voice. I made it millennia ago to oppose Mekonis. But why are you imprisoned? The Monado controls the principle upon which life is based. The source of your existence. Ether. Master the principle of life, and all things will bow to you. Your power would be infinite. As you now know, the sword gives the wielder the power of foresight. And I myself once used that sword against the Mekonis and defeated it. You're telling us you beat the Maconis with that tiny thing? <laughs> its appearance is merely an illusion. Its form morphs to conform to the will of its master. Yo, I can turn this shit into a sandwich? From within. <sighs> the sandwich but from the first couple of cutscenes in this game was super that powerful. Is why the high Entia imprisoned me here long ago. That can't be true. Our forefathers would have had better reason. You are what you are. Do you not believe your own eyes? Open your mind, new ruler of the High Entia. The Monado is the blade of the Bionis, the only force that can oppose the Maconis. As the wielder grows, so too does his ability to control all things. Yet there is still power trapped in the sword. The Monado is in shackles. Shackles? It is suppressed. You mean... Shackles. Czechoslovakia? Could it be a buggy? Yo! We got Carby. We got Monado Mobile. Dixon does yes, like bikes. We can turn it into a Harley Davidson for him. Faced Mekon. Mekon which cannot be destroyed by the Monado. <sighs> Mekon that can't be destroyed by the Monado. Can I get that eye filter on iPhone?
These shackles. They must be the reason the Monado can't hurt people as well. Does that have something to do with the faced Mekon? You must find that out by yourself. I will remove those shackles for you. But you must take the Monado and free me from this prison. Battleface so sure is taking a long time to let go of that. Cut down anything you wish. Nothing but a god can stand in your way. What a god? Oh, whoa, whoa, Don't whoa, whoa, whoa. hang on. Jesus, I know Jesus was in Xeno uh, Saga 3. And we did also crucify Juju. But no, we can't do that here. I thought you of all people would understand. I do, but it's just... Hold on a minute. He only said he'd release this new power. Sounds like a good idea to me. But... Melia, please understand. I must do what I set out to. The Mekon must pay. Hmm, scrumptious. It remembered what equipment Fiora died in. That's nice. She had a helmet on. She was being safe. I will not force you. I ask for nothing in return. It is your choice. I will. I like that noise as well. <laughs> Sounded like Ganondorf Warlock Punch. Let the shackles be released. This party's over. Oh. No! <laughs> the Drakmire Fist. Also rip. It's him. The he last giant is now Sorry, fucking extinct. What do you think of our leader's gift? How did Asshole. you know we'd be here? What's that? The poor insects are a little confused. We're here for the old fool. <laughs> If he's dead, he can't power up the Monado. You being here just an added bonus. Ah. How are we doing parkour? Flying parkour. Zanza? Respond, Zanza. I know you can hear me. I sense thought waves. Zanza, how many more will you sacrifice? Who are you to talk to me? How dare you? You know nothing. I am here to talk, Zanza. Zanza, you, do you need to vent? I like the way Metal Face like slid his claws into the screen like peek boo <laughs> The fingers aren't red so they could you could just cut them? That's true. They, he does not have the Cheeto puffs on his fingers. Who are you? Who 
How do you know me? Let's see if this jogs your memory. Yo, he's got some moves. Oh, that reminds me. I know a 3DS game I need to I need to download. What's the fucking fighting game that has Metal Face playable? Monolith worked on it. Project X Zone, yeah. Damn, he just fucking. <laughs> he just fucking went up to that guy and said, Metal Face is like, my servers aren't working. Try Control Alt F4. No, Ricky! Surprisingly, clothes not stained. <laughs> Looks like he's had his wings clipped. Did you really expect to beat me? Man, he sure charged that down smash. Oof. I failed you. To the also, did you see the fucking Zanza's toenails? Zanza, Who gave that alive. man a pedicure? Give me the power I need. I also, whoa, well, put that away. Put that away. The power is already yours. What? He's making the Majora's the Mask moon face. Serious it's moment ruined. The people of Bionis will never let you triumph. Correct me if I'm wrong, but that symbol that appears just now. What is that? Actually, I, I forgot. I thought it said machine, but no, that's what it says when he does Buster. Oh uh, shit, we can do level 10 now! And suddenly his voice got like a million times more shit. Now why did I choose to not play as Shulk here? I don't know. I don't know why I didn't do that. <laughs> no, I don't know. Everyone always plays this fight as Shulk, though. I'm I'm unique, okay? I'm you. Just go ahead and call me unique streamer. Can somebody help me, please? There we go. He's just as loud as Zord. At least his voice is like, yes, but like. His voice is more tolerable. It's not like I oh, do like a flood, but no. Hit his other arm, and then his leg, and then his other leg. 
and then a secret third leg. Is this what you truly desire, Zanza? I see now. It is as I suspected. Put that bright ass sword away. Outside the pre established harmony. Is that. Shid. Zanza, you were not changed at all. That is clear. But still, I cannot do as you please. Fiora! Wait! My mission is complete. Returning to base. Joe. Fedora is still alive. We were too late. Again. I saw it. I knew it would happen. Shulk. Why? Why did this have to happen? <laughs> Father. Melia, the hope of our people. You must not cry. Don't say that. I don't care how improper it is. Let me cry. Melia. Why does it have to be me? If all it takes is to be half Holmes. Is that what you think? You are very much mistaken. But... To become the hope of the High Entia is a fate that you choose for yourself. As long as you remember this, it is certain that you will be worthy of that name. But remember this also. It is not because you are the hope of the High Entia that I love you. It is because I love you that I wish for you to become that hope. <laughs> Heir to the Monado, I leave the sword in your hands. The sword that my forefathers sealed away. With it, you can succeed. Your Majesty. Uh, Melia, uh, cry for as long as you must. But when, when your tears are dry... about your empire and your people's hopes. If you need me, I will be at your side. But you are an individual. You are Melia Antiqua. And you can't let them get away with this. You're right. My foremost concern is making them pay. Well. Well played indeed. 
Zanza. <laughs> I do what is necessary for the world. I could very easily have stood in for you. I just noticed something really weird with Alvis's necklace. The fucking Zohar doesn't fucking have physics, but the rest of it does. Like it's like stuck to his chest. <laughs> but the rest of it like moved around when he moved his neck like that. That was really weird. <laughs> so, uh... One character is... turns out to not be dead, but... With it, the game's like, no, there still has to be death in this game. Finally. Crown Princess oh. Melia's accession will take place Can one die. year from today. Until such time, as decreed by the Crown Princess, I shall assume Imperial duties as Regent. If there is anyone who objects to said decision, state your grievances now. All the ministries are unanimous. We have no objection to Her Majesty's decree. To each and every one of you, our thanks. If I may, Your Highness, I would like to propose a roundtable discussion on strategy concerning the Mekon. Ah, what to do about the Mekon? Our defenses must be shored up immediately. Not only our defenses, Your Highness. Do you suggest an offensive approach? While the capital still licks its wounds. Mm -hmm. The Ministry of Research has the ideal What's solution. What's it taste like? What's that? Hmm. Definitely chocolate. Ricky, don't Friends be sad. Strange. A friend sad? Ricky sad too because of empty belly. Ricky empty belly. Ate. Us homs don't get upset just because we're hungry. Not hungry? Oh, hum hum must have small bellies. Oh, Ricky jealous. We've got to get our minds off this somehow. Dumban's locked himself away ever since we came back. Hmm. Whoa. Minato looks sick now. I forgot what Monado 2 looked Is it like. Because of the girl who was operating that mech on. Melia. How are you? you never really see anyone mean, draw this Monado. If you were talking about father, I'm fine. I have no choice but to look to the future. You're stronger than me, Melia. Do not mock me. Whatever there's like fan art and stuff. Importantly, it is time you tell me who she is. We've known her all our lives. We thought she was well, she's got the jutes, the jeans, she's the whole jouch. Boots with the jeans, apple bottom jeans. She didn't even recognize us. What the fuck you say about me? She's not the Fiora I remember. It looked a lot like If you know, you know. But if it was her, then I can't imagine how Dumban feels. What did he mean? Fiora is Dumban's sister. <gasps> I didn't know. Is this Fiora important to Shulk? Important? She's more than important. She's the reason we're out here. And so it begins. If that really was Fiora, why didn't she reply to me? Fiora. I'd better talk to Dunban. He'll know something. Alright. Well. Um. Eh. Yeah, I'll go talk to. Well, hang on.
Is there dialogue back here? What do you all you got to say? Eh? Where did Dundun go alone? Jock think he go eat by himself and no take us? That not right nice. Ricky want rice and a go to. Speak. Shock about you and Fiora. Um, it's nothing. What's oh, up? okay. What's up? Shock. Don't go stressing out by yourself. Don't banner me are there for you. Yeah? Shock, why don't you go and get some air? Need some time to calm down and think. Is it really telling me about bleed and shit from that fight still? Where's homeboy at? Well, he's out there. And Ben is like G O N E gone. Dunbar, where you at, buddy? Where you at? You, you must you want some beans and rice. I got some beans and rice if you want any. You like Taco Bell? I got rid of the chalupas, but they still all right. It's online only, Shulk. It's I've dumb as hell. So this is where you were. Shulk. Apologies. Was everyone worried? Of course. Me especially. Hmm? It's just... I've been thinking about Fiora. And I can't help wondering. Wondering what? You saw how Fiora acted. It was like she didn't even recognize us. Yes. It's unsettling. But Shulk, don't get me wrong. I'm not sad. Even if she doesn't recognize me, I'm glad to know she's alive. Dunban. You see, Fiora was born many years after me. What's that guy to do Not long afterwards, we lost our father to a Mekon. It was left to me to protect and raise her, almost like a father. I was always jealous that she had you as her brother. Ah, yes. You and Fiora used to be inseparable. Yeah. I need to tell you something. I always thought if Fiora were to be with anyone, it should be you. What? Where the fuck is this coming from? With her just as much as me. Yeah, he does. But Fiora doesn't like him in that way. Oh. I see. He's a nice guy. Reminds me of myself when I was his age. All reckless and hot-headed. Probably why he's not right for her. Listen, Shulk. Yes? A lost life can never be returned. But she's alive. It doesn't matter that she's lost what? her memory. What is this yeah. gangster pose Dunbar is doing? Right. Fiora and I have spent our entire lives together. The memory of that can't have disappeared completely. It's up to us. We have to help her remember. Help me, Shulk. Help me get her back. You know I will. Okay. Let's go tell the others. Hey, they're back. Have you gathered your thoughts? Oh, you're yes. back. Sorry to be a nuisance. Sure. What did you do to it? You? Yep. All thanks to Dunban. I'm glad. Forgive me. His Highness Callion summons you. You think something's happened? We won't know until we get there.
All right. Well, uh, I think that's as good of a place as any to uh, end for today. Chuck will sit on his throne. Um, yeah, there's plenty of quests and stuff I could be doing right about now. Um, it's heart to hearts out there in the world. It will eventually open up to us. I wonder, did any of those open up at this very moment? Um. Oh, I can do this one now. Uh, because those two are at purple now. I didn't even notice that happen. But all right. Uh, yeah, there's, there's a couple. There's a few. But I don't really have uh, the affinity for any of them other than the one at Bonus Lake. But uh, I'm just going to end there, honestly. We can do that heart to heart next time. Just end right there. 54. 55. 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59. And now we're counting, and I don't know why. All right. <laughs> That's going to be it for me today. Like I said, slightly shorter stream for the Xenoblade front. That's okay. Um, probably going to try to take tomorrow off. Maybe I'll, I'll be here. I'm not really sure. Um, we'll, we'll see, but it, it's probably a good idea to give myself a day off considering I've been streaming for the last four days in a row now. So yeah, uh, probably a good idea. So I'll be back on uh, Sunday in that case. Um, unless I just really, really feel like streaming tomorrow, in which case maybe I will, but I don't know. I don't know yet. Depends on what I got going on. Um, but yeah, uh, you guys take care. Uh, and uh, more Xenoblade soon. Now the, now the story is starting to really get interesting. So if there are people that are watching this for some reason and haven't played the game themselves and you plan on continue watching, well, let's just say things get even more interesting. Uh, in the future, in the near future, even. So, the future is ours to decide. All right, bye.